Day 12. Seeds are one of the most interesting phenomena in God's creation. If you saw a black watermelon seed by itself, you would never imagine that it would one day grow into a giant, delicious fruit. Or if you saw an acorn alone on the ground and didn't know where it came from, you would never imagine that it would one day become an enormous tree. Seeds appear to be so unbelievably insignificant, yet over time, they become wonderful creations. And one of the main ingredients is time. We live in an age where everything is at our fingertips in an instant, yet scripture describes almost all spiritual realities in agricultural terms. We wanna see our prayers answered immediately. We want that child to stop his wayward ways and turn back to God. We want our spouse to come to Christ. We want the trials we are going through to end, and we want it now. In today's reading, there's a story of a man in Africa who saw another man planting a fruit tree. How long will it take for this tree to bear fruit, he asked. 70 years, replied the man. Do you think you will live long enough to enjoy the fruit of this tree? No, the man replied. But when I was born, I found many of these trees planted by my father and grandfather. Just as they planted trees for me, I am planting trees for my children and grandchildren so they will be able to eat the fruit of these trees. There are probably a lot of seeds in your life that you may never get to see the final fruit that they bear. But your prayers are watering those seeds and God is cultivating those lives. Do not grow weary, do not be discouraged. God is in control and he is always working in our lives and through prayers of his people.